and welcome to Epilepsy Awareness Day at Disneyland. I'm here at the Epilepsy Alliance America booth and I want to introduce you to Lisa. Hi, I'm Lisa Gallipoli. I'm the Chief Operating Officer of Epilepsy Alliance America and we are so excited to be here at Epilepsy Awareness Day at Disneyland. Epilepsy Alliance America is a collaborative of organizations across the country who are serving people with epilepsy. So our mission is really to provide tools and resources so that our organizations can be out doing what they do best, working and serving people with epilepsy and using those tools and resources and not spending time back at their offices reinventing the wheel. We have on-demand seizure first aid recognition training for individuals, for school personnel, and we've had thousands of people in 40 states across the country take that training in the last 12 months. Hey guys, I'm here with the Purple Ladies of Houston and we are kicking off the 10th Annual Epilepsy Awareness Day at Disneyland Expo. Wait, so I had heard rumors that this was a pretty spectacular event, so I came with high hopes and those hopes were greatly exceeded. Um, just seeing the people, the community of out here you know, learning, connecting with others, and uh, and us having an opportunity to, to talk with different people and families impacted by epilepsy has been pretty amazing. Hi, I'm here with Mary and Joe from Domesta Pups, and they're going to introduce us to some of their four-legged friends. Um, can you tell us a little bit about um, what these dogs might be what <laughs> what these dogs might be trained to do in order to help someone who's having a seizure? Sure. So there's two things. One, we have seizure response, and that's where once the individual has a seizure, the dog can come in, he will ring a bell, do some kind of a notification, so he lets the family know, hey, we have a problem, we need help. So then he will go back to his person, he will roll them on their side, and lay behind them so that they don't choke. And then he will stay there until someone releases them, or the person says, we're good, we're ready to go do something different. Like, go get my meds, go get the phone. He can go and do other things afterwards. That's great. Thank you so much for being here. And um, we look forward to hopefully seeing you for many years to come at the event. Hi, I'm here with Kate from Child Neurology Consultants of Austin. Kate, I hear it's your first time here at the event. It is. So what has been your favorite part of the expo or epilepsy awareness day in general? Getting to meet all of the families has been so much fun. We have gotten to meet people from all over the country and just kind of hear their experiences and that has been great for us. And I think really just meeting all the kids and hearing about their journeys has been the most fun part. You know, everybody's journey in epilepsy is different. And for me, one of my favorite quotes is from Mark Twain. And he said that the two most important days in your life are the day you were born and the day you find out why. And this is reminding me why.